Okay, Irish, this is it. Just from the front part of the engine. Um, look to the two big, two big black boxes or covers, which is that. Let me just put this over here. Um, Alright, this is the driver's side. Uh, left bank of the engine. Okay. What I'm referring to is right about there. Let me try and get closer. That is that black there. With that screw on it, with that um, electric plug to it, you need to just unplug that electric plug. And underneath that is the uh, cam shaft sensor. Okay, so <clears throat> it might be just a little bit tricky just to take the bottom screw off, but it's held together by an Allen key. The top one is pretty easy to get to. The bottom one just needs a little bit of improvising, but you could get to it because it's underneath that um, cable. But it should be pretty easy to get to. Uh, just take some time. And uh, you'll be fine. Okay. But once that comes off. Let me try and get to the other screw. There we go. Once the screws come off. You see right through there. That's the other screw on the bottom. Once that comes off, the cam sensor pops right out. In there is just a whole bunch of little copper windings which generate uh, electrical current, and that's what tells the um, position of the camshaft, which is cylinder number one. Where it's at all the time, so the uh, distributor is going to fire the right way. Okay, if that goes bad, the car's not going to start. So, good luck with it, and uh, let me know if you have any issues. Talk to you later. Bye.